Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I want to share with you guys entry number 22 into my IC card challenge. This one comes to me from Alexandria Garcia. Um, and I'm not sure if she makes YouTube videos, but if she does, I of course will have her linked in the description bar below. So go over and check her out. Um, so we will go ahead and get started. So this is her IC card, and I think it is super, super cute with this um, little flower she's got all over down here. Um, and then inside the middle of these flowers, she, of course, has got some flatback pearls in these. And then she's got the little pink um, flatback gems as well. And it says, the best is yet to come. And that is so incredibly true. I love the washi that she has um, across the top of it. Um, I've not seen this type of washi before, so I'm, of course, interested in this washi. Um, so thank you so much for taking the time to enter in my challenge. I hope that you are feeling better. Um, I know that she hasn't been feeling that great. Um, so I'm hoping that you are starting to feel a little bit better. Um, I, am, I thought about you today, and then I thought about you yesterday as well. Um, so, um, just know that, you know, I'm here, I'm thinking about you, and I hope that you're doing great. Um, so here's her IC card, and it does not say that she has a YouTube on the, um, back of it. So, again, I'm not 100% sure if she does videos or not, but if she does, I will link her down below. Super, super cute IC card. Thank you so much for taking the time to enter my challenge. And I'm going to set this out of the way so we can... This is her pocket letter. Here we go with this. Give you kind of a whole outlook here. Super, super cute. I will show you row by row as it fits better into my camera. And I'm going to just feel of this. I'm not sure what kind of... Look at how fragile this trim is. That is super, super cute. I love that trim. Um, if you watch this video, I hope you can tell me, remember where you got that at, because I think that is super dainty and super, super cute. She's got all these little flatback pearls all over the cr front of it, scattered throughout. And then she's got this love tag right there, and of course that little flower. And then in the second pocket, this looks like it's washy. Super cute washi, and then another little flower there, and sprinkled with some flat back pearls as well. And again, with this gorgeous little trim she's got going around here, um, flat back pearls, of course, and then another little flower. And then here she has got this vintage looking flower inside here, again, with that stunning little um, trim that I'm a loving. I really like that trim. I don't know, maybe that's like a washi, like a ribbon trim that's got sticky to the back of it. I can't quite tell. Um, but she's got that same image in this pocket as well. Super cute. And she's got this sequin trim around this pocket. And it says, a leap of faith never fails. And that's exactly right. Um, I love that as well. And then on the bottom here, again with that awesome trim, and it says spring has sprung, and she's got a mixture of flatback gems as well as um, flatback pearls. Then we have, again with this washi border here, and a cluster of flowers in the middle of that one. And then here's another one of them tags, like this pocket over here. This is an actual tag on here. And it looks like, you'll have to let me know if you painted that yourself or if it came that way. It looks like you did it yourself or inked it somehow. And then here we have spring is in the air and we got all these flat back gems again with the pearls and the trim that I like so much. Super, super cute pocket letter. There's another look at it from the top to the bottom. Super cute. I love it. Good, good job on the pocket letter. So there's one. And then she also sent me another pocket letter. And this one 
I'm not sure the material that you used, if how you pieced this together. It looks like it might have been a gift bag, but maybe not. But can we though, guys? I mean, really, look at how super cute this is. And it looks like she has got tinsel or some kind of fiber. I'm not sure. It might be an actual glitter on there. I'm not sure what that's called, but I like how it creates a little bit of texture in the pocket. And she's done the same with this butterfly. The, it is actual textured in there with the, um, it looks like tinsel fibers, but I'm, I could be wrong about that. But it is super cute. I like how she's added it to the pockets. We've got, she's glittered this, this flower out as well as this, um, this one down here and she looks like maybe added some blue glitter very creative how you took the image and then just kind of made it pop by adding the tinsels and the glitter to it I just think it's absolutely gorgeous and I'm sure the camera is not doing its justice um, I'm quite certain that if you guys seen this in person I love all these big flowers let me see if I can get the you see how that's all shiny in there, guys? I mean, it is super, super gorgeous the way that she has just added the glitter and the tinsel fibers and things to make it um, pop. I really, really like it. See if I can pick this up for you guys. I don't know if you guys can see that real well, but they're actually like little... I guess they are. it is glitter, but it's like tinsel. You know what I mean? It's like longer than like glitter. Like these little pieces is part of that. Super, super great. Awesome. I love it. Thank you so much for sending me not one, but two pocket letters. They will go in my book. I have a binder full of all the pocket letters I have received. And then, uh, look at these. She sent me some ATC cards. This one says Dream Bold Dreams. And it matches her IC card here where it's got the same washi and the same flowers on it. Super, super cute. I was just reading her information. And here, this one's mixed media. I'm not sure if we have used paint. It almost reminds me of nail polish. But I could be totally wrong about that. You'll have to let me know how you mixed media this one. Alex... Good things take time. Absolutely. I love them. Thank you so much for sending these to me. I really do appreciate it. Aren't those great? I really like this little bird down here. And this big gold heart. Super cute. And then she sent along goodies. And here we have orange bows. Which I really, really like. My high school colors were orange and black. Um, and so these will look really, really fun on like some summer projects. So thank you so much for sharing these. And then we have, oh, we're stuck together. Then we have these gorgeous flowers. And they're three-dimensional, so they kind of pop up. You see that? Um, look at that little mushroom. How super stinking cute is that? And I don't have anything like these. I wonder where you got them. And then here we just have some of these, um, what are these called? These have a name. Um, they kind of feel like epoxy, but I know that's not the right name of them. And they're just the little banner pieces where you can attach something inside of them. Um, they're not epoxy. They're something. There's a specific name for them. I just can't think of it off the top of my head. I probably will in 20 minutes. So these are super cool. I don't have anything like these either. So thank you so much for those. And then, this is a little bag of, it looks like, die cuts. Let's open this up and see real quick. Y'all know I love die cuts. Oh, she's made them. They're little embellishments. Super, super cute. I couldn't tell that they were stacked together inside the packaging, but now I can tell that these are embellishments she has made for me. And that one says, happy. I love how you layered. She's also popped them up so they look dimensional. You see that, guys? Super, super cute. So that's one there. And then here is another one with a bow, a big bow and a big um, diamond gem in the center of it. Super, super cute. 
And then here is another one, um, like the first, except for this one says adorbs. That is super cute. That is super, super cute. I was look, looking at it off the camera because I want, it almost looks like that's hand wrote, but I think that that is on, um, came on the little piece right there. Super, super cute. Thank you so much for those. I appreciate that. So that's a set of embellishments, two pocket letters, and her IC card. That's 20 points. And then, of course, she has sent this little bag of goodies. And I see Rose Cabochons. I love these guys, and I don't have any this big. I do have some of these um, that I just ordered from AliExpress, but I love them. Um, I love the coral colors, and I like this um, pale blue, mint green colors. And I love yellow for summer and spring. Thank you so much for sharing these with me. I'll probably hoard them for a while because I don't have anything that big. And then she has shared these cupcake liners with me, which are super, super fun and colorful. I really like colorful things, so thank you for that. And inside here, we have a mixture of bits, which I love. Look at this little... Oh, can you see that? Am I going to have to take it out? This bag, I will kind of share some. I'll kind of take some of these out. We have some of these. Um, why is my camera being not so nice to me today? I think it's trying to pick up. Anyway, I'm not sure. I don't know if it's because of the coloring. But this is um, a... Um, like a little plastic cabochon and it is in the shape of a sunflower and there's also a green one in here see if maybe if I give you the green one if it won't show up better nope it's not wanting to but that's what they look like very very super cute I don't know why it's not showing up correctly but it's not it doesn't want to and then she also has some star pieces in there as well as um, some googly eyes and some flat back gems as well. So thank you so much for all those awesome goodies. And inside here is some also some journaling cards, which I love. I don't know what the deal is with my camera. There it goes. This one says you rock. This one's a really pretty paper there. And then celebrate today and let's celebrate. I really like the mild pinks and the gold together. And then I've not seen these, but these are little foam tulips. Super, super cute. Those would be perfect for spring. And then shut the front door, guys. Look at this. Look at these mason jars, guys. I have not seen these, but I am so glad you sent them to me because I love them and I will probably hoard them now. Um, but they are the wood piece um, uh, mason jars, which I love. And then also she shared with me a couple of these binder clips. So thank you so much, Alex, for entering my challenge and taking the time to do so. Um, like I said, I know you haven't been well, so just thinking about entering my challenge would have been good enough. But I really do appreciate you. And um, I don't think she does videos, but I'm going to go in there and check to see if she does do videos, guys. Um, and if she shared it anywhere, I will go ahead and give you the extra points for that as well. But right as it sits, you have 5, 10, 15, 20 points um, just sitting right here. So if you have earned any additional ones, again, I will go in and add them. All right, guys, thank you for taking the time to watch my video. Thank you, Alex, for entering my channel. I'm praying for you, and I hope that you continue to feel better, and I hope that you're feeling good today. Um, all right, guys, we'll see you in the next video. Bye!